The Your 6-Month Assessment Statistics page lets you view a breakdown of the 6-month assessment data entered by your team for a date range that suits you. To view the Your 6-Month Assessment Statistics page, go to Clinical, then 6-Month Assessment, then click Your 6-Month Assessment Statistics. Select your team from the drop-down box. Then select a date range. You can sort records by clock start or by six month assessment. Clock start is the time when the patient first arrived in hospital. This selection will show a breakdown of the six month assessment data entered by your team for patients who first arrived in hospital between the 1st of January and the 30th of June 2020. You can view a breakdown of the six month assessment data for patients whose assessments are due now by sorting by clock start and setting the date range to four to eight months ago. Or we can sort by six month assessment. This selection will show a breakdown of the six month assessment data entered by your team for patients who received their six month assessment between the 1st of January and the 30th of June 2020. Select the team centred radio button to view a breakdown of the six month assessment data for six month assessments that were performed by your team. Select the patient centred radio button to view a breakdown of the six month assessment data for all patients seen by your team but whose six-month assessment data may have been entered by your team or by another team. Patient-centred results may be useful for acute sites who do not perform the six-month assessments themselves, but have teams further down the stroke pathway who perform them. Once you have made your selections, click Refresh. Scroll down to view your six-month assessment statistics report for your chosen time frame. The report includes the number of patients for the specified date range that did not die on the stroke pathway the numbers of patients with no locked six-month information entered at six months, and the numbers of records locked to six-month follow-up. Followed by a summary breakdown of the six-month assessment data entered for each question in Section 8. It should be noted that only records that have been locked to 72 hours and for patients who did not die in hospital are included in this report. The numbers in this report may differ from those in reports produced by SNAP as the web tool cannot perfectly replicate the central analysis performed by the SNAP data analysis team.